Hello everyone. Welcome to Aptitude Jab. This is a caselet. It says that there is an apartment with 60 flats and the water supply to the apartment is provided by <coughs> a nearby reservoir which has capacity of 60,000 liters. The reservoir gets filled only when it becomes empty and for three months we are given the data that how many fats, flats were occupied and what was the consumption rate etc. Now this thing uh, is quite simple. Uh, we need to just understand one thing in this is that uh, like whatever is the uh, flat, okay, suppose some the number of flats and their consumption and their uh, like number of flats into consumption will give us that how much uh, consumption will give us that how much uh, water is being consumed and uh, like if we multiply with the fill rate like how many uh, uh, that gives us the capacity of the tank okay so this is one thing that we need to keep in mind like in time and work we have that uh, man days and hours so here we will have capacity will be equal to number of flats into consumption into fill rate okay now first question asks if the tank was empty at the start of november how many times should the reservoir be filled during the month okay so if it is uh, big in the beginning it is uh, empty so we will find that how much was it used okay that will give us the number of times it was filled now 50 percent of the flats were occupied that means 30 flats are occupied okay and each flat is using 25 liters per hour 25 liters per hour and then it is for 24 hours okay that is in one day and in a month you have 30 days right so this is the consumption and we need to divide it by 60,000 because <clears throat> that is the capacity of the tank. Okay, so we can clearly remove two zeros. Now 24 into 25 is 600. So that means the tank was filled nine times during the month. Second question, the consumption of water per hour in November was what percentage more than the consumption of water in December, December. Okay, so in November the consumption rate is uh, twenty five. We have to compare with respect to the consumption of water in December. Like what was the conversion rate, consumption rate? Now in December, like seventy five percent of the flats were occupied, and uh, we were uh, we have to fill the tank after every 100 hours so that means number of flats occupied were 45 75 percent of 60 flats consumption per hour we need to find out okay and it was filled every 100 hours so whatever is the consumption rate uh, this will be consumed all over uh, overall okay and then if you fill it every 100 hours that gives you the capacity which is 60,000. So this gives us that consumption per hour in December will be 600 by 45 or we can further divide by 15 which gives us 40 by 3. Okay. Uh, so uh, it is asking that what percentage more than consumption in December. So December 40 by 3 it is 25 or 75 by 3. Okay, so uh, it is increased by 35 and 35 out of 40 is 7 by 8 or 87.5 percent. So that is the increase in the consumption rate of water in November with respect to in December. The next question asks how many flats were occupied in January? Okay, uh, so it says in January each flat consumed water at the same rate as in December. Same rate as in December means uh, 40 by 3 liters per hour. And it takes 125 hours to empty a completely filled reservoir. 
so we will use this thing again we need to find the number of flats occupied into consumption rate is 40 by 3 liters per hour and fill rate is 125 hours so that is equal to 60,000 so when we <coughs> do the calculation okay so uh, this becomes 60,000 into 3 and it is 40 into 125 40 into 125 will be equal to 5000 and 5000 60000 it will be 12 okay so 12 into 3 that is 36 flats occupied in january now the next question says in february the tank capacity was increased by 20 percent but due to some constraints the tank could only be filled up to 80 percent of its new capacity if the reservoir tank was filled 14 times in the month and the consumption rate per flat was 24 liters per hour what percent of the flats were unoccupied in february now what happens in feb is the tank capacity is increased by 20 percent but the tank could be filled up to 80 percent of its new capacity so if you increase by 20 percent that you mean you make it 120 percent and you fill it only up to 80 percent so that means this is 96 percent okay so this was 60,000 6 into 96 576 so here the capacity is 576 double zero the reservoir tank was filled 14 times in the month and the consumption rate per flat was 24 liters per hour. What percent of the flats were unoccupied in February? 14 times in the month and consumption rate per flat was 24 liters per hour. Okay. So now uh, number of flats into consumption into fill rate gives the capacity. Okay. So uh, we are given that so uh, we have to find the total usage we have to find that what percent of flat were unoccupied so suppose there are uh, x flats that were using water okay so consumption rate is given as 24 liters per hour okay and uh, they will work for 24 hours okay and uh, uh, into 28 days as well because february has 28 days right so this is the total water that is consumed like x lit x flats each flat consuming 24 liter per hour okay this is number of hours in a day this is the number of days okay that is equal to 576 double zero that is the capacity and we will also multiply it by 14 because it was filled 14 times so one time if it is full this much is used and if it is filled 14 days or you can directly do it also this way also that this this is will be filled once in two days that can also be applied that if you fill it once in two days so instead of this we can multiply by two also and get the same result okay so uh, x liters per hour uh, <clears throat> x is the number of flats 24 liters per hour 24 hours in a day and in two days we are filling it completely okay so uh, we will get x the number of flats that are occupied are 57600 by 24 into 24 into 2 so 24 square is 576 so this leaves us with 100 and divide by 2 it gives 50 so 50 are occupied and it is saying that unoccupied unoccupied will be 10 which is 16 or 16.67 percent so this was a basic set using some uh, basic calculations just that you need to understand that how to find the total capacity so this is the solution to the set and the answers to the questions <coughs>